Welcome to Chick Beer with Hophead and Porter. I'm Porter. I'm Hophead. This week we're going to be tasting the Port Brewing Company's Wipeout IPA India Pale Ale. Yummy. So, are we ready to try this uh, bad boy or what? Absolutely. <clears throat> you want to do the honors? No, I think that you should. You have a steady hand and more attractive hands than I do. Yes, they're beautiful. <laughs> see how this looks on the big screen. There we go. That is not the best pour I've ever done. It's okay. You only have to do, yeah, there you go. Look at that. See, that's got a pretty big head on it. Yeah, this might be interesting. Yeah. Well, let's do it again for the pretty camera. <laughs> pretty Damn, camera. Do it again. You're fine. I, it's good to do beer that way. You want, I, Ooh, look at this. I like it. You, you, you want a head on it because that, you know, it gets it all going, mixes together because it tends to settle in the bottle. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. That's a good thing. <clears throat> so oh, I can pour the rest of that bottle in there. All right, don't be stingy. We're splitting up. It's 50-50 here. You know it. I'm very intrigued. Look at this. It's, and it's not going away either, the head. Yeah, uh, and that's, uh, that's very cool. It's really, it's like opaque. Yeah, it smells good. That's a really uh, it smells solid hot. beer. Oh yeah, it does. That's a good test. Um, <clears throat> as far as I've been able to tell so far, as uh, hoppy beer goes, if you can smell it before you drink it, you can smell that it's it's going to be a little bitter and hoppy, mm -hmm. then very aromatic for a treat. And it is. It's very. It's not thick, but you can see sediment in there. Yeah, and you, you know, literally you cannot see through this. You see my hand? No, you don't. <laughs> you don't. <laughs> so I, I could. Well, you're behind it. No, woman. whatever. <laughs> All right. Well, are we getting anything? I'm just smelling. Hmm? I just smell hops. I don't think I smell any particular. Enough you know, fruity things are popping out. I mean, I mean, maybe a little a, there's bit. There's a hint of something, but I can't. Uh, These all, I can't decipher it. They always smell like apricot to me. I don't know why. Yeah, all maybe, beer. No, no, no. Like the high, mm. like high hoppy beer. It always tastes like apricot to me, or smells like it. Mm. Well, yeah, mm -hmm. and you can still see it's still not set, settling very slowly. Mm -hmm. I'm so excited. Yeah, it should be really. All right, let's try it. All right, this. cheers. Cheers. That's good. It's very hoppy. <laughs> mm. It's not very hoppy. For me, it's nice though. It's a smooth hoppy. It is smooth. It's very smooth for a hoppy beer. That's really cool actually. <clears throat> it is. A lot of, lot of hoppy beers. This is bitter. And yeah. you taste it the whole way. Yeah, you do. You can taste I mean, it all the from way from the, the back very tip yourself. all the way back, and long after you swallow too. I mean, this is this is this, this is nice and bitter. Um, but it's not with a lot of bitter beers. There's a tendency for you drink them and then right around back here it's a little dry feeling. Mm -hmm. No, I'm not getting that. No, I'm not getting it. But normally that's. Am I right here or am I just, am I saying it no, wrong? No, no, no. I know what you mean. It's, yeah. it, it feels dry. Dry yeah. is a good you way mean, to you know, describe yeah, it. it. Sometimes they're so bitter that they get, by the time you swallow them, you kind of almost cough a little bit, mm -hmm. you know? Uh, not at all, but this is really smooth. I'm surprised at how bitter it is, though. Oh, I'm, I'm not. I could do with more. It could be a little hoppier. But then again, I'm hophead, so... <laughs> Yeah. How's Porter, how's Porter feeling about the hops? Because Porter's not, not really into the hops so much. No, not so much. Um, I don't know, this is smoother, a lot smoother than a lot of the, like, the really, like, Indian pale ales that I've had. Like what? <clears throat> Can you name any that you would... Um, no. I can name a few. Yeah, name some. Um, I'll tell you if I've had them. Put it that way. Uh, Retrieval is much Stone. Better. Stone IPA. I have not had Stone IPA. Okay. Um... 90 minutes. 
Yeah, I've had the 90 minute. I've had the 120 too. The 120. It, it, it's in a different The 120 class. is an IPA, but you just can't compare it to any other IPA. It's completely different from. And it doesn't matter if it tastes bad because no, yeah, you just drink the shit out of that. <laughs> mm-hmm. That's some good stuff. Yeah, it's good. We'll be doing we'll be doing a whole um, uh, 120 show. We're gonna have a couple people and we're gonna drink a whole bottle. Each. Um, yes, each. <laughs> I really I kind of want to do that next. That would be so much fun. Yeah, that would be fun. But we're, we're not watch gonna, people we're gonna, slowly melt gonna, into their <laughs> chairs. Start getting really chatty. Yeah. <laughs> I'm very grinny. Mm-hmm. We're a little bit off topic. I yeah, think. a little bit. I mean, we should get back on topic. We should. All right, so... I think we're at the point of, uh... Yeah. It's question time. Yeah, so... My what friend. Would you buy a six-pack? Yes! Pack? If I could find a six-pack, I would buy it. And since I can't find a six-pack, I'll buy more... I'm just going to buy six of those I'll and put them in a six-pack. Buy six, six pack. of these and put them in a 12-pack. Oh, how do you like that, Pennsylvania liquor law? <laughs> That's what I thought. This is really good beer. I'm super happy with this. If you like hoppy beer, I would recommend this. It's one of the smoothest hoppy beers I've ever tried. Um, it's not the hoppiest, uh, it's really but it's very good. And, you know, it might be too hoppy for somebody who's not into that kind of beer, but... Um, I would make them try it anyway. <laughs> Time to a chair. <laughs> drink it. You drink it. <laughs> I drink your IPA. <laughs> Porter. Yes. Would you buy a six pack? <laughs> Upon answer. first reflect, reflection, I would say no, because I mean, I'm. It's not bad. It's not bad by any means. I'm just not really the the hoppy, super bitter type of beer. I prefer like a smooth, porter, smooth. some stouts, you know. Um, but you know, this, that's the that's the bonus about the the high alcohol beer. It does. <laughs> After a while, you don't care. Yeah, and it's actually it's going. <laughs> It's smooth to begin with. It but is smooth. It's surprisingly smooth. But like the bitterness kind of fades away as you get further down the glass. Um, but you I know what? You're right. It does. It does. It does. It's really at first, weird. it was really like I was just that's all it was. But it was like I guess teeth. Maybe you get used to it. Mm. <laughs> it was like teeth. Yeah, it's like it's a really bitey. That's why <laughs> bitter is bitey. All right. For the future it references, it's bitey beer. We're just gonna okay. refer to it as that. We got an IPA. It's bitey. But, yeah, I mean, it, I don't know, it's not bad, it's got really, it is really kind of flavorful beer, it's just not any particular flavor, <laughs> I don't know how to describe that. Yeah, we didn't um, actually talk about that, it is, um, there's kind of a lot going on in here, it's not, mm -hmm. it's not so complex that I'm like, wow, you know, but it's not just bitter. Um, yeah, it's definitely, it's got different, there's a lot like, as on. it goes down, you have the bitterness first, and then you got kind of like... Nice. It, it almost is creamy. creamy yeah. yeah, right in the back here when you yeah. swallow it. Which is interesting because you know a lot of hobby beers just don't have that. And that's when you get that dry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go now, <laughs> <laughs> and we'll okay. see you next week for more chick beer with Hoppet and. That's right. Cheers. Mine's gone. <laughs> <laughs> I drink on it. I got more. Bitch. Bye.